Hey Ultimate Iron Man fans, welcome back to another episode of Empyrean Galactic Survival. This is your host Zealot, and we're here today doing the Season 1 of the Ultimate Iron Man competition. And you can see I've got the whole mole with the five drills there. Well, that was very instrumental. We put the, we've now got 15 of the, um, solar panels down uh, the sun's about to go down though but that's okay what we're gonna do before the sun goes down is not jump out but we're gonna go down I'm gonna show you the base I finished I went came back to the submerged tank and dug it out a bit okay so we'll just head down there And so here's my little garage I made. This will uh, this will work for the two vessels that I plan on having down here. So we'll just uh, here. Let's go down and just turn this off. I already transferred all the stuff out of the fridge. So, oops. Here, let's get out. So I'll show you around a little bit. I basically dug this thing out with because this thing I would have never really made a base like this as a an Iron Man starter because come on, digging this out would be ridiculous. But with that thing it was super easy <laughs> with the five lasers on the front. So I made a a kind of a dangerous equipment room here. So we've got generators, couple of small generators back there, a couple of capacitors. Uh, fuel tanks, and it's now running on battery. Nice. Let's take a look at what it was. It was averaging 278. Okay. Consumption was less than what it was averaging. Yep, excellent. So it's still charging up. We've got a good charge into the battery. We've actually more than 50% on the battery. Excellent. Um, what's our fuel like? Oh, almost full. So as long as you don't waste your, I mean, I could turn some lights off. I still got to do some switches and make it a little bit more efficient, you know, make, uh, the lights all automatic. So censored lights so that when I get, walk into a place that that particular light will come on, but we'll, we'll get into that stuff later if I need to and time permitting. So here's my little construction area. I've got a deconstructor and a couple of advanced constructors. I, I, um, the ones that I looted there, that was awesome. Uh, I made the deconstructor. Uh, we've got pretty much everything in here is looted except for a couple of things. I think I made the Wi-Fi's. Uh, yeah, pretty much everything else is, is looted. I haven't made any grow plots yet. I got to get on that. And we've got our garden going. Uh, we've got a good selection of vegetable. Oh, wow. Those are all pretty much ready to pick. We should. Uh... Okay. So what I'm going to do, I will connect to the fridge. That way, what I pick will go directly into the fridge. And we'll just run along here and pick everything. The reason I do pumpkins is because you get more, you get six vegetables per uh, plot. And come on, give me, thank you. And the uh, wheat is the same way. I think it's a better yield and same with the oranges is the best yield for fruit. So there's a reason why I use specific ones. It's not necessarily the time it takes because usually I'm gone longer than what it takes to grow anyway so for me what's more important is the actual yield per grow plot okay uh oh well let's just popped up in front of our eyes let's pick those two and are these ready too no growing okay growing so once those are done we'll we'll just use them to make more so we need a full full two or full rolls of spice and we're gonna have to get some buds we need buds, mushrooms, and um, 
berries, buds, mushrooms, and berries. And then well, that, that'll that pretty much complete the garden out, and then we got to just continue the plots down. So yeah, it's going to be a decent size, you know, close to, I think it'll be close to 200 plots or so. I, I didn't count it out, but this is, this is like 80 or something here. So yeah. Uh, okay. Well, let's spawn in the SV that we cooked up. Should be able to just fit it in here. No problem. Lots of space. I kind of, I kind of went overboard a little bit. Now, um, I was going to show you, I had some videos of me constructing this place and that, and really I just don't have time to edit and, and do all the stuff that I need to do for the competition. So uh, you're going to get pretty much condensed videos and sorry guys, that's just the way it goes. So yeah, you never got to see me build a base, whatever. It's a competition. It's not a, it's not a let's play. Uh, let's play the no um let's spawn in our we're just going to bring in our box top that we built in 8.6 it'll work fine in nine and it's cheap enough and it can warp and it has missiles it has a little bit of armor at the front it can take on pois we might and we can upgrade it a little bit too so i think uh, i think it'll be good for us to start with and it was the only thing i could really afford that could warp so, and I think it's really important right now for me to get a SV in. So here we go. Uh, it only has two of the uh, tier one rocket launchers, which we're going to remove right now because I, I can actually make a couple of the tier two ones. So what we're going to do is let's, let's actually here launch our drone and we'll go and grab our Three blocks. Let's make sure that this is set to. I'm not going to get bit again. Okay, that's set to private. Good. <clears throat> okay. Um, let's pop these out because we'll deconstruct them and we'll see if we can make. Uh, we should be able to make two of the of the higher end ones anyway. I know they do less damage, but they have better range and they can track their target because they're homing. I know they're a little bit more expensive to make. Um, and I, I get that. I understand that, but I did get to a couple of silicone deposits just because the, the whole mole can literally plow through time and space. <laughs> well, no, it can, it can dig through the earth and make a hole to the deposit, which it did. I only needed to do it about 50 feet or 50 meters to get to it. So it wasn't, it wasn't a big deal. Uh, they, the, the bases don't have as big a range as they used to. They weren't sh starting to shoot at me until into the into the high 200s, 200 meters. So it was like, oh, okay. Well, I can get much closer to them now. So, so I think atmospheric density is really kicking in now. Uh, if it's at around one, you're getting about half range. Okay. Well, let's see if we can make this. I'm, I don't know why I had the drone flying around. <laughs> <laughs> let's let's go oh you know what i think i put those uh i probably those are probably in the fridge right <laughs> probably threw those in the fridge now i that would have that would have not have worked if that had been the uh because look at like they, they wouldn't have it's crazy they're too heavy right what are they ah i can't it's okay let's just move them here 400 so that's 800 a piece well still you know what oh it's all the, oh it's the water oh water is so heavy check see oh wait it's everything else too eh oh the stones geez i didn't realize i had so much stone there <laughs> whoops right now it doesn't matter it's gonna matter next season it's gonna matter and all my other playthroughs from here on are all weight restricted enabled so yeah Okay, what I've done is I've made a bunch of cargo boxes up there for specific purposes, really, so I don't get all freaking whack a dude, um, especially deconstructing inappropriate things. So what I can do is I'm going to throw the those into my deconstruct one. It's clearly labeled, so anything going in there, when I turn this on, is going to get deconstructed. 
And right now I have it going into mats, my main mats, because yeah, <laughs> that's probably where I need them go to go anyway. So let's do that. Oh, so we're going to get a not much. That's too bad. That's too bad. Well, we'll see what we can make. We'll see what we can make. At least we'll get a bunch of electronics and iron back. That's fine. That's fine. A little bit of copper, and, or a little bit of uh, cobalt and neo from from that sathium too. Not much. I mean, it all it all adds up, right? So, <clears throat> okay. So let's see what we can make here. I know we can make. One, so we can just go into output one for now. That's fine. Okay, and actually, let's. Well, we're gonna make two for sure. And I'm gonna try for four. If we can't make four, I won't. I'll only mount two. I won't mount three because it it. I'll be wasting ammo, and the reasoning being is because usually you can kill things with four missiles and I want to one shot things or two shot things I don't want to yeah I'm not going to be able to anyway that's fine we could only make two that's fine that's fine and I'm not going to make two more that would be ridiculous I'd be an idiot to do that but I'll make two more of the the homing rocket launchers once once we have a chance to do that obviously I want to upgrade to plasma um cannons because they're supposed to be awesome now so got to do that but we need pentaxid for that we're going to be like level 20 to make the ammo so that's that's way off well let's load all this stuff and take it up into space now one of the problems i have right now is oh you know what can we sh crap we we should have actually got food going here we didn't get much food made so let's well, we're standing around yakking. Uh, yeah, we can just turn all this into burgers. <laughs> just turn that into burgers. We'll take some burgers with us. Damn. Okay. Uh, our, our, our trip into space might be limited by, by food. I do have a couple of emergency rations, so that's, that's, that's very useful. And... Okay, I think I was still connected to this fridge, right? When I picked that? Yeah, I think so. Wasn't I? No, I'm not sure. Um, also, yeah, I'm not going to worry about the rest of the farming stuff. We'll let that cook up. It's cooking up burgers. And let's go install the... Oops. The homing rocket launchers. And then we'll throw down a bed and sleep, I think, while it cooks up our food. Uh, okay, so let's, what's in here? Is that just regular steel block? Yeah, but we do have the outer shell is hardened steel on the front there. So it can take a, it can take a blast. It's not. It's not just made out of butter. So let's install these. Uh, where the hell did I put them? <laughs> just, just put them somewhere, didn't I? Did I not put them somewhere? Did I? Did I just not grab them? I guess I didn't grab them. That's fine. Um, So, no, we're not going to use the fridge to hold that with. We'll just go like this. And put that in our bar here. Okay. Can that go in any? Nope, that's as far as it'll go. Okay, we want that all the way in. Yep, good. And all the way in. Excellent. Excellent. Well, that's good. We upgraded right away, so we won't be using the, 
the uh, non-homing missiles at all. We'll just be using the homing missiles. That reminds me. So that's the other thing we got to queue up for. Um, we're not going to be able to make many, though. We're not going to be able to make many because we don't have much uh, in the way of, what can we do? Let's see. Okay, so that's the homing ones there with the electronics. Magnesium powder two, ouch, ouch. And that requires, we get 10 per five, just like regular ore. And we have how much? Not much, 20. So we can do 40. Divide that by two is how many times we can do. So we can do 20 times. We can do 20 times and each one makes seven. So we can make 140. Well, that's not bad. Hell, that's not bad at all. Well, let's do that. I'm pretty sure that's the right ones. Let's just double check. We can look here. It requires the 135H MSL. These are the 135H MSLs. So we're going to make, we can make uh, 10, 20 of those. And that'll give us 140. Okay, excellent. So that's spinning that up. We've got food spinning up. Let's, let's, Let's double our efforts on food. Let's see if I can make more. Um, what else? It's got 13, 18. It can make a ton. So let's make a whole ton. We'll make, yeah, like freaking 20 hamburgers. That'll keep, keep us fed. Yeah, because they're worth 200 a piece. Yeah, we'll be able to go quite a quite a long time on on that. Actually, let's do thirty. Fine, fine. We'll just take a whole whack of hamburgers with us. <laughs> okay, let's lay down. Uh, let's lay down a bed and go to sleep, and then we'll take this thing up into space. Exciting, exciting progress. Progress getting getting closer and closer to mission objectives here. So. We need blocks. That is, we need the deco. I think I got some in here. Yes. Okay, we're still in the fridge. Let's disconnect from the fridge and we'll just, let's connect to the blocks right now because this just feels weird. Not needing the fridge. Okay, so let's put a, let's put a little bedroom over here. This corner, I'm going to have actually an elevator going up into the uh, ocean there um, for the, generators i'm going to make a little sealed generator room and it's going to be cool and everything so yeah and but not yet <laughs> i just don't have the time no time okay so let's put a bed um hmm i kind of want to watch tv while i'm in bed ah that's fine you know what we'll just we'll go like this for now and we'll go to sleep. Okay, excellent. So everything should be done. Let's take a look. So if we go into the output, there we go, 140. And then in the fridge two, we've got our 31 hamburgers. <laughs> well, so we'll eat uh, one of them right now, 30 hamburgers. Okay, that's how you do it. And nice. So what we can do now is we can make sure that this is turned off to get maximum efficiency because we're not going to use it now. We've got our ammo. We've got uh, oxygen. We've got we'll, we've got a bunch of fuel on us. And yeah, this is exciting. I don't have an EVA though, so that's not good. So that's not good. Okay, so let's disconnect from there. Uh, we're just going to grab this stuff. We'll grab the output. Grab all that. And then we want the... Uh, where did I put that? Where did
did I put that? Uh, did I put that in blocks? Where did I put that now? Derp a derp, mats too? No? Um, why am I being so derpy? Where did I put all that O2? Uh, mats 1. Mats 1. I, I didn't actually put it into a secondary container like I should. i got to remember to do that. Okay, so I think what we'll do is we'll take a, a smidge of the fuel with us. I don't need all that. Just in case. And, I mean, that's not a lot of ammo. We just don't have a lot. We can take some logs with us, though. So let's... Good enough. Fuel, oxygen, ammo, food. We don't have an EVA, though. So... Whew. And the other thing I want to do is uh, grab stuff out of... Oh, i got to make a... Um, got to make the Wi-Fi. That's the other thing, too. So let's do that. Let's do that. We can do that here. Really quickly. Right there. We'll just turn this on. Go to output one. That's fine. And then while it's doing that, we actually need to go into the hover. Uh, actually, let's, let's fire this up to get the food in here so it stops spoiling on me. And we'll go like this and manage that and we can go like this nice nice okay we, we we should have plenty of fuel for what we're gonna need and then we'll go into the oxygen and throw that in nice and then uh, we don't have fuel for that then we want the fridge go like that um, now we got to distribute through some cargo here. So the ammo, like that. And then cargo box one is huge. So, so the three cargo boxes are really big. I'm going to use cargo box one uh, as my mats. I'll use the Cargo box one is store one one as storage, and then that'll be the output. Okay. So input. Uh, let's link to that. So we also need to grab stuff out of the whole mole. I want to grab. Leave the heavy armor in there. I want to go sell these medium armors if I can. Uh, we're going to upgrade the rocket launcher later. We can sell that. I, I'm going to hold on to the ammo there. We can sell. I want to take a bunch of this for sale. There's some money straight up. And we had extra night vision. We had a couple of, so we have an extra shotgun. Yeah, that looks good. That looks good for now. Uh, actually, oxygen bottles, small ones, we'll take that. That's good for emergency purposes. Uh, drill charges, you know, we'll take those for now. The tent, we'll take the tent. You know what? We better take meds with us. Goodness bite, I don't know what we're up against. Radiation, that might be a good thing to have. Yeah. Uh, radiation poisoning, that might be good too. Okay. Yeah, that looks good. We'll, t we'll take meds with us because I think when you're out in space, you're screwed if anything happens to you because you, there's nothing to pick, right? So... Uh, not, not to say I'm going to get poisoned or anything. I think it's more of a radiation scare than anything. I don't, I mean, there's radiation burn there. I got three of those. Dermal parasite, I don't think is going to help. That will heal me outright. So we're going to take that. Okay. 
Okay, and we're gonna leave the heavy armor here. I'm not gonna take the heavy armor. I'm not gonna need it. Yeah. You know what? Let's take it. We, m I might have to put it on to, to like jump out onto the moon or something. I don't know. I don't know. Let's, let's take it anyway. So, um, let's go into our. Here, we're going to go into the control panel. We're just going to make sure that everything's turned off for now. Go into the lights. And the grow lights are separate. We're just going to turn them off for now. Okay. So let's make sure we got everything organized here. We got our ammo in, we can turn our oxygen and lights on because we're just going into space right away here. Um, yeah. We've got drill, we've got, oh, I don't know why I grabbed that. I don't know why I have this on me. It doesn't matter, it doesn't matter. Okay, so we need to grab the submerged tank output one and then this is cargo box one that's fine let's jump out spawn the drone okay um you know what let's just put it down beside or on we could do it on top that's not bad no, because I want to reach down and be able to 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 use it without an interference, without the Wi-Fi screwing me up trying to touch it. So let's just go like that for now. It's going to be a little bit of not super balanced. This thing's not the greatest balance for weight restriction in any way. I'm not going to be using this. Obviously, it's it won't work. So, but you can notice now that it doesn't drift anymore. It just, if you have a well-balanced vehicle, it'll stay where it's supposed to. So you can just, you can just kind of aim how you need to and then just go. You're not all getting screwed up. And I figured out, oh yeah, let's, let's do this. I figured out why this was getting all screwed up. Is that it? No. Oh yeah, it is. There we go. No, is it not going to work? Oh no. Uh, no, it's not going to work. Okay, so let's... <laughs> I went a little bit too far back. And a little bit... Can that go down? No. Uh... Let's go back a bit. There we go. Okay. Good enough. It'll it'll work its way out. Okay, so let's head out into space. <clears throat> Exciting. We'll um, let's load up our weapons. Oh, there was some ammo in them. That's weird. These ones obviously won't because I just made them. Okay, we're out in space. We're out in space. I can't jump out or I'll die. So we need to like go to the moon and hopefully we find the trading station. Really is the big, that's what the plan is. That's basically it. We're looking for the trading station. So I'm gonna fly to the moon and I will meet you guys there. Okay, we're back and we just came down into the uh, surface of the moon here and we, we came down actually right on top of the seam by the look of it, but that's okay. Uh, we immediately discovered a silicone deposit. There's my radars picking up a whole bunch of hits to the 
to the east and west. Now, when we looked on the map here, um, the west has a Xerox zone, so I think I want to go east here, and we'll just we'll just hold, oh oh, what is that? Something just appeared over there. Let's just come in really slow and cautiously. Oh, it looks like we're, oh, it looks like maybe a wreck. Yeah. Okay, so watch out for drones. Watch for drones. Oh, it's a wreckage. Maybe we can get some more thrusters and stuff off it. So there's a drone. There's a drone. Okay. And temperatures are, oh, well within my tolerance for the armor I'm wearing. So I don't need to switch it out for heavy. And, oh, look at all those thrusters and everything. This is just like the one down on the planet. Oh, hallelujah. It's going to have, like, oh, yeah. Look, oh. Here we go. We've got. We've got the rest of what we need to put together a CV. Okay, well, we'll, we'll take a look at that. I'll, I'll loot that later. Um, let's keep exploring here. I just want to loot this guy really quick. This got looted. Yeah. Okay. Um, so, it looks like we're getting a hit over to the south. Really cool. So I want to zoom out just a little bit here. Ooh, cobalt! That's what we're looking for. We're looking for it. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Right in front of us. Okay, just fly a little bit further. There we go. Nice. Small. I don't know what small means, but... Well, we'll be mining that out too. Okay, something to the east now. It's up to the east. Nope, must be southeast. If it flips back and forth between two, uh, two compass points, then it's usually right in between them. <laughs> right? Makes sense. Magnesium! Perfect! Alright, okay, so no more... Oh! Oh, 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 drone. Okay, so drones can't shoot straight up still, I don't think. So if we went, like, straight over top of him, came straight down, he's just dead. He's just dead. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we can lower down here and loot this guy. Excellent. So I'll be coming back to these, like I say, uh, off camera. There's no need for to subject you guys to to hand mining these things. Till I get a CV, I can't bring an HV up here. So uh, keep heading east. Keep heading east. Let's check our map here. So we've crept down to the kind of been going on an angle. That's fine. We'll. We'll, um, we'll continue then to the east. We'll just do, do east a little bit south. Just so we uncover the last square that touches the pole. Okay. That should be good enough. I can kind of see the pole there. And... Oh, what was the size of this? Oh, it's size 3, actually. It's a fairly decent size. Wow. Okay. That's fine. <clears throat> oh, we're getting another hit on our radar. Let's make sure we... And it's getting into darkness here. Uh, let's try our night vision. Hard to adjust to it at first, but okay, it's not too bad. Sometimes it's it's like worse. Sometimes it's like oh whoa 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 what is that? That is something. Okay, let's pick up this 
I don't think it looks like a shooty though. And there's a drone? Okay. Okay, let's pick this marker up. And we'll go deal with the drone. That looks like another crashed vessel of some sort, doesn't it? Like maybe the DSE again? <laughs> another... We get the two same crashed vessels? Okay, well... DSE mid, doesn't that have the two... All the gear on it? I think it does. All the grow plots and everything? Ooh, a large... It's a large drone. Nice. Okay, so let's... Range of... Oh, 400! Oh, right, because the uh, atmospheric density. Okay. Woof, that gets a little bright with the headlights. So let's turn that off. Come down. Oops, nope. That was just... Come on. There we go. Yay! Our first big drone kill, I think, isn't it? It all it's it's all a blur. I'm pretty sure it is the first one. Oh, let's do this then. Thank you. Jump the same height because I hit my head, but somehow it lets me spawn my drone if I have my jetpack on. Um, yeah. Even though that stops me every time because I bump my head on the thing. But for some reason, when I have my jetpack on, I can spawn my drone. Don't ask why. Just go, go with it. Just go with it. And yep, this is the full meal deal. With all the grow plots, everything. Wow. Okay. Holy crap. So, yep, with the CV turret and everything. Yep, more thrusters. All the sathium from this stuff right here. Nice. Okay. So we'll come back to this. That's all. It's got loot in it. It's got stuff. I know. But that's awesome. So we found it. More to the east. Looks like more to the east. Okay. And did we turn our lights completely off? Okay, so our headlights are on. Can never tell. I... Uh, it's really dark. Okay, maybe we do need night vision. Nope, three things. So let's go this way. And Promethium. Ooh. Like I say, I'm not going to sub. Oop, entering Xerox territory. Yeah, that's fine. And you, you need to die then. You can't shoot up. Ha 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 ha. Yeah, I shouldn't get lippy. Probably as a friend. Or 50,000. Okay. A little bright when we get down low. I don't mind loot and fuel and ammo that I can use right off the bat. Very handy. Okay. More hits. Lots of radar stuff. Lots of radar. Ooh, that's a shooty base if I ever saw one. That's a shooty base. Let's see. Let's see what it is. We're going to do a... Uh, we're going to come at it straight from up top here and oh yeah you can just you can just float now oh this is so weird getting used to I used to have to like dance to get my v vessels to do this now it just really we can just come straight down on top of them and what's my range 400 Really? Okay, so where's the... Here, let's get rid of that. And... Well, nothing's shooting at us. Can we, um... Oops, not that. Can we... 
zoom in. Come on. Ah, dronage. Well, let's kill him then. So it said it's an armory. I don't see any turrets though. Really? Are there no turrets on this thing? See any? Oh, it looks like you can tax it over there. Nice. There's no turrets? I remember there being turrets right where those are. Did are these custom ones that um, Know It All DM put on here to make it a little easier for for the start to get to get some resources? Because these things, this POI is like just a loot box. That all it is. It's it's just a big giant freaking loot box. Um. Really? Because I could just, like, literally, the core is straight down the center of this, isn't it? Oh, I feel like I might be cheating here. It's just, it's too easy now. What the hell? Really? Can I just go like this and, like, core it? Let's see. Okay, that's one block. Oh, yep, that was the core. That was two blocks core. Okay. Uh, Wow. Did we nuke the zone yet? Yeah, we nuked the zone around it. So it definitely cored it. Okay, that might have been a little too easy. I didn't actually intend to do that like that, but you know what? I'll take it right now. We need the resources. There's going to be a shit ton in here. Okay, let's, let's go back into the... Why do I keep hitting the wrong buttons all the time? I suck. I just suck. Okay, here we go. We can do this. We can do this. We can we can get control of our controls. And yeah. Okay, so that's that's just a big piece of loot. The whole thing, everything about it. And I probably didn't get close enough for anything to spawn. Right. Let's let's let's. Let's take a boo. Let's have a listen. Now, there are the new spawners that will, I believe, even if the base gets cored, if the spawner exists, it will spawn the dude once for sure. I believe there's like special mechanical hidden and you can make them hidden so that they just, it's a one shot deal regardless if there's, if there's even a core or not, I think so. I still think we we need to be leery. Is there any way for him to get through there? No? Okay, so let's land. Let's land here. Let's land on this. Can we get... Is this just too, too wide to get by? There, let's... Ooh. Yeah, we're a little tubby, aren't we? Just a little tubby. Straighten out a bit. Ah. Let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Okay, okay. Straight, straight. Come on. Yeah, 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 yeah. Can, can we do this? Oh, 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 oh! The screens. Oh, the windows. The windows. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Can we? Can we? Oh, we're bumping it. We're we're jamming. We're jamming. Can we? Just a little bit then. And then if we. If we go like this, right? Just, just some, some, some angling. Oh, oh, oh! We can do this. We can do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Burst free! Do it, do it. There we go. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We can land now. <laughs> just, I could have just went straight down. Uh, God, I suck. Okay, so let's turn the engines off. Because this is probably a good place 
I'm just going to loot a bit and then we'll call it an episode. <laughs> so let's turn the engines off. Oops, I was right there. Ugh. We'll just fill. Oh, can we? Now, how do we do that again? If we're tied, I believe, let's try this. If we're tied to the proper, hmm, they look yummy, but we don't need to eat one yet. Uh, I think if we're tied to the proper cargo box, so let's, let's tie ourselves to where the fuel is. No, I had it on me. I have it on me. Oh, is it because I'm tied? I can't do it. No? Can we just go into here and do the fill all? Where did I put all the oxygen? Oh, there it is. Right. Uh, okay. <laughs> okay, cargo box one. See, I was, I was already connected to it, wasn't I? No, maybe I'm one one. There we go. Now I'm one one. So now that I'm connected to the oxygen, the cargo box with oxygen in it. Let's see. Yep. Now it works. See that? So you don't actually have to have it on you. You have to be connected to a container that has either the fuel or oxygen in it or both. So you could just connect to, you could put both, you know, that's not bad now. Good to know. So put a little bit of fuel and oxygen in a small container and that can be, you link to that and then just, I don't know, whatever. <laughs> they don't listen to me. I'm just an idiot. Well, this idiot's gonna loot. <laughs> oh my goodness. Uh, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Um, oh, we should have made a core. Well, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. We're gonna find a core. We're gonna find enough mats to make a core. So let's. Oh, let's um bring up our. Yeah, there we go. So we'll... I bet you we can. Yeah, see, we'll get stuff like we'll we'll get we'll get we'll get stuff together to make a core. We'll get we'll get it. We'll get it. We'll get the mats. We'll get the mats. We can do this. Come on, we can do this. Come on. Okay. <laughs> Don't make me look like an idiot in front of you know my nine followers. Okay, come on. Yes, iron. Okay, so we're getting closer. What do we need? Silicone. Um, computers. We have, okay, that's good. We need we need more of those. Ooh, that might do it. That might just do it now. Uh, a little bit more silicone, and I think we'll be golden. No, that's not going to do it. Okay, so let's uh, put this stuff into the here. That's kind of where the mats are going, right? Okay, that's not mats. Okay, oh, wait. Yeah, I was going to sell all that stuff too. Or did I screw up and put the wrong... I don't know now. I was putting it all into there. Uh, I put it all in the wrong container, didn't I? Oh, well, too late. It's going in there now. Too late, too late. We can pull all that out and sell it. Okay, we're back. You probably noticed I actually had a core in my backpack, so <laughs> here I was, you know, starting to beat on cargo boxes and had a core. Anyway, so I put the core in. Uh, we looted, we, ch we changed the faction back, we looted everything going into, um, so I changed the faction private, took all the fuel and oxygen, I can't take anymore, it's, there's not enough to take, uh, and then <sighs> I'll show you how many cargo boxes and containers are, were in this place, it's, it's insane, here I'll just uh, go into here, so I've already like you can see here's just tons and tons of loot and stuff and oh, a couple more drill modules so we can we can finish off the uh, whole mole when we get back I looted an EVA 
so that's huge. I didn't loot any more armor, but we did get a whole bunch of odds and sods and a bunch of um, nice, nice stuff. Some neo and sa, a um, little bit of, of magnesium, which we need right now, and some cobalt. So, so good stuff. There's good stuff that we looted. But look at how many there was to loot. It's crazy. So here's the drop down <laughs> list of of all the stuff in the armor. <laughs> it took me a while to loot. And that was after smashing like 10 of the containers or so probably easily. So yeah, wow. Well, um, I know where to come get, uh, get some uh, hardened steel if we need it. There's tons of this, this place is just full of hardened steel blocks. So I've looted everything, so all the alien containers are all empty now, so yeah. But yeah, everything's empty. And nothing spawned because we killed everything before it could, or we destroyed the core before the spawners became active. <laughs> so yeah, that was a bit of a, um, yeah, that was a bit, I, I was just trying to count how many blocks there was to the core and it pop through and just kill the core instantly so whatever whenever we'll take it we'll take it it's not illegal we didn't do anything illegal immoral maybe illegal not really so i am gonna go mine the crap out of this moon hopefully find i know maybe maybe another armory to loot <laughs> if so that'll be just uber so next episode we're gonna be back on planet assaulting the defenses for the mission that i have to have accomplished uh, in the next day or so so until then you guys have yourselves an awesome awesome day <laughs>